Welcome to Tech Brothers with Amir. In this video, we are going to learn what is between logical operator in SQL Server. Let's open SSMS and take a look on definition and then on a scenario. Between returns true if operand is within a range between logical operator is used when we want to return the row if operand is within range. So that's the definition of a between logical operator. Uh, now let's talk about a scenario. We have a DBO customer table where uh, one of the column is the uh, age. Now, if we would like to return all the records from DBO customer table where age between 33 and 60. So that's our uh, requirement or scenario. What logical operators we can use? As we are performing a demo about uh, between, so we are going to use between to return these uh, results. So solution. We can use between logical operator to test the ranges uh, that if the if it is true then uh, rows will be returned otherwise uh, we will not get any results uh, for uh, that condition so now if we have a db customer here we have age column here and then uh, we are going to insert some uh, records fine nine records are inserted now let's go over the between definition a little bit in detail and uh, uh, see what are the things to consider when you're writing your uh, between uh, uh, logical operator in SQL. Between returns true if the value of test expression, so in this case we are saying age, that's our test expression, is greater than or equal to the value of the begin expression. So we are saying greater than or equal to. So this is our begin expression. So we are checking this. Uh, this is our test expression and we are saying between this is our begin expression. So it should be greater than 33 or equal to 33 and less than or equal to the value of the end expression. So it should be less than uh, 60 or equal to the 60. So it will as long as the age is less than or equal to 60 that row will be returned. We can use below query to return our results. Let's run the query and you see that we got the results. It also did include age with 60 and 33 and one of the value that lies between 33 and 60. So just remember this part. Test expression is greater than or equal to the value of the begin expression. So it is going to include these values as well if it will find because it consider this one greater than or equal to to the uh, to the value of the begin expression or uh, sorry and uh, less than or equal to the value of the end expression though in our case that's a 60. Now why I'm emphasizing a lot on this uh, equal to uh, here because if you would like to use not between and that work in a little different way so you will be surprised oh this this does include uh, 33 and 60 but when I use not include it ignored it yes so that's the tip or a point to remember when you are writing a between uh, not between so we can also use not between that will return true if the value of the test expression is less than the value of the begin expression or greater than the value of the end expression. So you see that here if we are saying oh give me all the records from DBU customer where age not between 33 and 60 that means it is less than 33 it will return you all those records and uh, also it is going to check the second condition or uh, greater than value of end expression that's 60 so you will get all the records where your age is greater than 60 so it is not going to uh, consider equal to part so uh, that, that's uh, just a tip or when you write it make sure you you know that what does that mean when you are going to say not between because equal to part or, or those records will not be uh, listed in your result set. Okay, let's go ahead and run this query and you see that it returned us all the records of where they were less than and where age it was less than 33. So we have 20, we have 12, 25 and 15 and 29 and also it returned us a record which has value uh, greater than 60. So it is 87. So that's how you will use uh, between and not between uh, logical operators in SQL Server. I hope this video is helpful and I will see you guys uh, in next video.